I think it's become quite clear that we, we most likely expect some kind of a response uh, from the U.S. administration. We're not sure whether that is going to be uh, in the form of new sanctions, possibly new tariffs, or that could just be, as in some cases we've seen in the past, just more uh, harsh talk. Uh, now, you'll see, the, especially the last bit of that statement where Trump said, we're not going to take it sitting down. You will see what happens, makes it quite clear that there is some something in the workings behind closed door and the similar message was delivered really on Thursday as well in the cabinet meeting uh, when Donald Trump asked his secretary treasury uh, secretary of treasury rather uh, about the sanctions and he responded saying that they were uh, all going well and that they are still uh, planning to do more if Turkey doesn't release Brunson quickly and as it stands now from the decision coming from the Turkish court that doesn't seem uh, to be happening anytime soon so at this point uh, the ball is in the U.S. administration. Um, everybody is waiting to see what a response would be like. But looking at uh, what we've seen so far, just in the past few weeks, there has been pretty much uh, action taken on several fronts. Politically, uh, both sides have imposed sanctions on ministers uh, uh, and, and their counterparts on both countries. Uh, and economically, we have seen a new, renewed tariffs coming from the states as the Turkish side also decided to boycott some of the electronic products from the United States and also military wise this has been a long uh, dispute the US decision to um, or attempt rather to boycott the delivery of F-35 sets uh, is fighter jets that is still pending and in response the US uh, the Turkish decision rather to um, uh, to buy S-400 missiles that's again uh, in the plans that is very much concerning Washington DC but I can tell you that at this point uh, from what I'm hearing hearing from the from some of my diplomatic sources on the Turkish side uh, some are worried that with more sanctions uh, possibly uh, imposed on either side uh, the relations the standing of the bilateral relations at this point they are concerned that it could reach to a point of no return